Hey everyone, my name is Nicole, aka Coach Fabby Fit. Welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. If you're a subscriber, welcome back. So I took a long break from my channel and I'm really trying to get into the swing of things and post more often. But content you can find on my channel in the future are grocery hauls, clothing hauls, toddler clothing hauls, mommy mo uh, movies, <laughs> mommy videos, uh, day in the life, things like that. Those are things I really want to start recording so if those are of any interest to you please don't forget to subscribe while you're here and with that today i am bringing you a fabletics try on haul i will be trying on all the clothes you're gonna have to bear with me because i don't have the best equipment i guess you can say like i don't have someone here to film me you know from head to toe i don't have crazy lights and a lot of space without furniture in the way and things like that so I'm doing the best I can so you really only can see from my head like to below my waist but that's fine because below my waist it all looks the same anyway right I'll tell you how long the pants are the leggings are that I'm trying on and yeah with that let's just get started right into the video okay so this is my third Fabletics order my first order was about a year ago I would say I, I don't have the exact date but it was a while ago and on that order on the first order I placed a pair of two I placed an order for two leggings and they were the same type of legging they were the power hold 7 8 high waisted legging I got a size, a size large in both and I got a black and I got a gray they came in <clears throat> and they fit fine you know they were a little tight but I like them like that to kind of hold everything in and keep everything in place so that was fine because I like them so much I placed another order again for two leggings I got one of the power hold because honestly if you find anything in your size like if you find what you're looking for in your size consider yourself lucky because it is just it's so hard so I got a power hold in the camo it's like a black and gray camo because that was the only one that I could find I got the Mila leggings in the Mila pocket leggings in bright red also so when I got the leggings I had just automatically assumed that the camo was gonna fit I mean it's so I went to go try them on or put them on I think just like wear them and they didn't even go past my knees like literally they did not go past my knees and I was like what the hell like I was mad obviously because like returning stuff online is not the easiest my printer is broken they don't just send you a slip they email it to you you have to print it whatever so I was not happy about that and then the Mila leggings those fit fine um, my my third order which was this one I ended up getting two pairs of leggings two sports bras and a top and everything was about $90 I think uh, not bad but I was really excited for the sports bras because I heard good things about the sports bras and I am a size 40 ish triple D and I need support. Those of you that don't know, if you're new to my channel, I am a group fitness instructor and personal trainer. So I am jumping around a lot on cycle. I'm do, I teach cycle, I teach Zumba, I teach all kinds of classes That's I need a, a strong bra. I've tried Under Armour, I've tried Victoria's Secret, I've tried She Fit when I was breastfeeding and I needed even more support. I tried She Fit and those are, those are, those are good, but my hair kept getting caught in the um, the Velcro because if you don't know what she fit is, they have Velcro adjustable Velcro straps that you go here, you go here, you go around the side. So as far as being supportive, that was, but it was just kind of a a bitch to put on, and also uh, it, my hair kept getting caught in it. So anyway, um, so I was excited for these. So they got here actually today, and I will show you everything. I will try everything on for you later on um, after I tell you a little bit about the pieces. So I got an all black sports bra that you just put over your head. I got another sports bra that has a zipper in front, which I found the best luck with um, at like Victoria's Secret. I got a pair of the power hole leggings in black again, but I sized up because I thought that they would just be easier to you know get on and not have to like move up the fabric inch by inch. Um, just so you know, I'm 5'8", and I weigh about 239 pounds, so I got an extra large in all of this stuff, because I'm carrying my weight weird. Um, before, when I was about the same 
weight. I, I was I weighed a little bit more actually, about 10, 15 pounds more. I carried my weight very differently, and then I lost 100 pounds, and then somehow I gained it back. So here we are, and I just feel like the weight is distributed differently. So I'm still able to wear extra large um, in leggings. So yeah that's pretty much it so i'm going to insert the clips here of me trying the clothes on and then we'll come back and we'll talk about what i think As far as the black le leggings, those are fine. The only thing I'm going to say about them is the one thing I liked, I liked a lot of things about the power hold leggings for sure, but the one thing that I liked the most about the power hold leggings was the material of them was like thick, but soft. I don't know how to describe it other than that. It wasn't super thick to the point where it was like making me hot but it was thick enough that I felt secure and in place and they were really, really soft. So these ones that came, power hold, same exact thing. They're different. They're like more slippy and less soft feeling. They're still soft, I'm gonna keep them. Um, but I don't know, I think it's worth noting that I think they're switching some things up as far as maybe manufacturing or I don't know, materials that they're using. I'm not sure, I don't know anything about that, but. I can tell you that as a consumer, they feel different. So there's that. And then the other leggings that I bought, those are also the Mila Pocket, what I have already in red. And they're fine. They feel the same. The material feels the same. Pockets are good. The pockets are great. Like if you're going to go um, on a walk or on a run, you can just slip your phone in the pocket. That's really nice. Let's talk sports bras. So, um, for the one with the neon green, first of all, neither one is high impact for someone like me. Neither one. They're just maybe yoga, maybe working, like sitting down, maybe going on a walk, maybe Pilates, but they're not high impact. When I think high impact, I think I'm able to run, I'm able to jump, I'm able to do jumping jacks and squat jumps and everything, and everything is gonna stay in place. No, that's not the case. So this bra that I'm wearing right now, which you guys saw, it's the all black one. I actually got a bra like this when back in the day when I used to do the Ellie activewear hauls, and it was by the brand Marika, Marika? It, it, I'm not even kidding you, it feels the exact same. Like it says, this is just, this is a mediocre bra. This is not a $50, $60 bra at all. No way. Uh, I do prefer the ones with the zipper in the front because I feel like they give me more support, but this bra is not it. it neither one of them were great, I'm telling you. Um, but they were comfortable. So I, I have found that the, there's an Under Armour bra that I have, a sports bra. It also zips in the front. And I wear that bra the most. I find that bra to be the most comfortable. Come on, I'm ready. I find that bra to be the most comfortable. I find it to be the most supportive. And I wear that bra the most. I used to love Victoria's Secret bras, however, they've definitely changed something with their bras also, and they're just not as comfortable to wear. They're a little bit stiffer. So, I was really excited for these sports bras, and I was like, these are going to be good. I couldn't wait for the package to come so I could try them on. I am going to keep them because they're comfortable to wear, and it's so hard to find like a bra for someone my size where it's not, I mean, these bras, I'm not gonna lie to you, they dig in to where they like kind of make your your sides pop out a little bit, but 
I'm not sitting here feeling like, oh God, I can't wait to take this off. I mean, I can't wait to take it off. Don't get me wrong. Like, definitely. But <laughs> I don't feel like I have to take it off. You know, I don't feel like when I take it off, I'm going to feel so much relief like I normally do. So if you guys have any recommendations for good sports bras for big chested and just bigger women, please comment it below because I am in desperate need of like five of them like good ones so there's that the sports bras they were a letdown and then the top it was just mediocre you guys like these clothes are not anything to write home about in my opinion now maybe if I were a little bit smaller maybe if I no they were good they were good if you can get the 50% off. Sometimes they have 75% off. Get the two for 24. I think it's worth that. To pay full price though? No, I don't think so. Not at all. You know, I think that you should take advantage of the two for 24 and try out the leggings and maybe size up. For me, for me, it's, you know, it's like a hit or miss depending on what colors and stuff you get. I've only ever tried the Mila and the Power Hold, and both have been good, but I did have bad experience where I ordered the same size and they wouldn't go past my knees. Like, that is insane. So, anyway, I hope this was somewhat helpful. I know I'm kind of all over the place because I'm just trying to put into words, like, I, I do recommend it to an extent, but it's not as hyped up as people make it. So, you know, do with that what you wish but um i definitely think it's worth to check out the website see if you can find anything for the two for 24 that you know is in your size i do actually have another order coming which i won't try that on just because that's like more for me just at home and i got two for 24 of the bicycle shorts those i don't work i'm not gonna work out in or anything like that those are literally just for, to be at home and like lounge around in but I'm excited for those because those are the power hold also so they should come up nice and high and I hope they fit nice and they're comfortable please 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 so anyway that's it for me today I hope this was somewhat helpful like I said if it was please give this video a thumbs up comment down below let me know if you have any sports bra recommendations and let me know if you like these kinds of videos because I don't mind doing them you know shopping trying stuff on <laughs> don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video